What's up, fam? This video is sponsored by Skillshare. Skillshare is an online learning community created for you. If you're looking around and you're like, where the heck are you? This is my Shuffle Master set. When I was starting Shuffle Master, I checked some of the courses that Skillshare had, and sure enough, there was a couple classes that were really helpful, one of which was YouTube Success, Build an Authentic Channel That's Worth the Follow by Sorella Moore. Authentic videos on how to really connect with the audience. Such a good class. There's also filmmaking from home. Turn found footage into a compelling video taught by Penny Lane. Also a really cool series of lessons that help you learn how to make stuff from home because we're all stuck at home right now. If you want to try it out, the first thousand people that click the link in the description below will get to try a free premium subscription. If there's no ads or anything like that, so if you want to start creating, this is the way to do it, man. We need more good people out there making videos and increasing their ability to create and Skillshare is a great way to do that. So go check it out. Click that link in the description below. That really helps us out as well. And let's just get on with the show, shall we? Hey, I'm Grump, I'm not so Grump, and we're the Game Grumps! Hello, welcome back to Game Grumps! Alright, is that real? Yeah. Is that how you're starting? Yeah, that's how Okay, it's great. It's just... Welcome back to Trigger Happy Havoc. Is that what it's called? Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, well, I guess that's the... Well, what is it really? Because Trigger Happy Havoc is the first title, and then it says Danganronpa. Is it possible that Danganronpa is like a uh, a larger property and this is just one game i think maybe like it would be fire red pokemon oh right well i think maybe it's the translation of dongon ronpa oh i don't know i suppose it could be dongon ronpa because also just be gibberish um you received the school crest present that's nice yeah that'll soften the blow of having to kill all my new friends well, you know, I didn't really like many of them anyway, so I'll just kill the ones I don't like. <laughs> Great. You must kill someone if you want to leave, just in case you needed a reminder of what happened in the last episode. My mind that froze. That is a helpful refresher. And my breath caught in my throat as I thought about that. I could feel a paralyzing fear slowly making its way through my body, dominating every last nerve. The air. That guy who you said looks like me definitely looks like a terrified porcupine. <laughs> 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 With platform shoes. <laughs> he shoots his quills all over. The air, the air hung heavy on me, pressing down like a weight around my neck. It took everything I had just to endure that weight. God, I'm getting so ripped from all this heavy weight. To survive. To survive daily life. We're only at chapter one, Dan. We haven't even started it. But for as heavy as the air felt, that's so, so weird. <laughs> just cut in the middle of it. Anyway. I know. <laughs> All it took to pierce it was her sharp words. That's you. So, what are you going to do now? Hey. <laughs> it's all on you. Yeah. Just stand around glaring at each other? Come on, start killing. <laughs> her point in Why don't you grow a pair of nuts? <laughs> her point in combat was directed at everyone in the room. It helped pull us all back to reality. Right. She's right. Listen to me. Sometimes, even if you're nervous or afraid, you just have to step forward and kill somebody! <laughs> to forget such a simple fact, I can't forgive myself. I'm so ashamed. You hear me? Please, someone hit me! I can't forgive myself! Somebody hit me! Punish me! Huh? What? Alright, dude, you've got stuff going yeah. on. <laughs> like, preferably one of those girls! If one of those girls could hit me! And step on me! And spit on me and call me scum! <laughs> Jesus, if you have time to yell about it, you have time to do something about it. However, Damn. Perhaps, but what is the mission exactly? Stupid. Idiot. To look out for a way out. Duh. What the? <laughs> I mean, tell you need to find out whoever was controlling that stupid bear and beat the hell out of him. I like how only characters that you voice talk to each other, and only characters that yeah, I voice amazing. talk to each other. <laughs> What a weird coincidence. But, but, but before we do do all that, maybe we should take a look at the handbook. It's probably best to check out the school regulations Monokuma mentioned before doing anything- ah. <laughs> <laughs> Our first kill is in the books! <laughs> True! If we stumble around with no clue what the rules are, something like that might happen again. Shit. Shit. Alright, so then... <laughs> Fine, then let's hurry up and check out the stupid rules already. 
Before I kill one of you. <laughs> totally. Roll number one. Don't get killed. Ow. After turning on my <laughs> e-handbook, the first thing that appeared was my name. So just like the Monokuma said, the owner's name showed up front and center. Then from the main menu that popped up, I selected Mono's... Mo oh, whatever. Saizano. <laughs> and I was like, one Saizano, please, from the menu. All right. The, an itemized list appeared on screen. It was the school regulations. In other words, the rules being imposed on all of us. On us all. Students may reside only within the school. Leaving campus is an unacceptable use of time. Okay. Nighttime is from 10 Great. p.m. to 7 a.m. That's just rules of the world. Some yeah, areas... that's just that's just the cycle of the the moon. <laughs> <laughs> Some areas are off limits at night, so please exercise. Caution. <laughs> <laughs> Sleeping in. <laughs> Sleeping anywhere other than the dormitory will be seen as slipping in class and punished accordingly with death. Right. With minimal restrictions, you are free to explore Hope Peak Academy at your discretion. Violence against Headmaster Monokuma is strictly prohibited as is destruction of surveillance cameras. Anyone who kills a fellow student and becomes blackened will graduate unless they are discovered. What? What does that mean? Uh, yeah, I don't understand. What does blackened mean? Like they're marked somehow? Yeah, and then they're discovered? So, so do you have to kill somebody in secret? Additional school regulations know. may be added as necessary. Feeling a slight dizziness, I raised my face up from the screen. I'm dizzy because I was stabbed. As I look around, I saw the same- <laughs> And I'm stabbed because I was dizzy! Whoa! <laughs> I saw the same stormy expression on everyone's faces. This is bullshit. What the hell kind of rules are these? I'm not gonna let them control me. Well then, why don't you wander around the school without a care in the world and see what happens? Personally, I would love to see what happens when someone breaks one of the rules. You already did. But if he got punished like what we saw before, I don't think there'd be a respawn waiting for him. Good, I play video games. <laughs> Good. Yo. Oh. Sorry, I just saw what my head looks like. It's like an anteater died and just kind of <laughs> stayed. Ever since I was a kid, I grew up with my older brother pounding this into my head. This anteater. <laughs> <laughs> when a man makes a promise, he has to keep it, even if it kills him. So what? what? <laughs> <laughs> I've made a ton of promises that I still have to keep. So that's so what? Piece of shit! <laughs> So that wow, that's his that's his basic line. Yeah. So I can't afford to die in here. None of that made much sense to me, but you are but you are saying that you will follow the regulations, is that it? That's you know what doesn't make sense to me? What? The fact that you can have two giant 1980s style telephone cords shooting out of your head in either direction. <laughs> oh yeah, well, I guess you're right. Not like me, cool guy with the corn on the cob. <laughs> <laughs> I eat it when I'm hungry. Hey, um, I have a question. <laughs> For regulation number six, uh, what do you think it means exactly? <laughs> Anyone who kills a fellow student to becomes blackened will graduate unless they are discovered. You're talking about the second half, right? Where it says unless they are discovered? I was wondering about that myself. It's saying that if you want to graduate, you have to kill someone without anyone finding out it was you. Oh, thanks, Byakuya! But, but, but why? Why do we have to do that? I don't know, tiny hands. <laughs> have you not been paying attention for the last hour and a half? <laughs> I don't see any reason to worry about it. Poor people die all the time. Just worry about following the rules as they've been explained to us. Such Sometimes by my hand. Frankly. Frankly, I don't want to hear anything from someone who waits for others to decide what to do for them. You know, I'm actually kind of surprised they didn't just like add in like, because it's like, you know, ultimate prodigy and ultimate baseball player. And they just, they had like ultimate serial murderer. And it's like, uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh, sweet. It's going to be easy. Did you don't jab him? Give me a break. More like a full on stab. Mm. <laughs> 
Well, for now, let's forget all that silly junk about murderers or whatever. <laughs> now that Are all 15 of us going to have a quip for everything? <laughs> yeah. Now that we know the rules, let's start exploring the school. Yeah, let's ex start exploring the school. I don't know what the school's going to be like. I don't know what the school's going to be like either. Well, I don't know. This is school. <laughs> <laughs> True. We need to find out exactly where we are. Where exactly we are. Is there any way out? What about food and supplies? You understand? Supplies! <laughs> there are tons of questions we need to answer. That's a weird out joke from UHF. <laughs> Damn straight. Okay, then th let's all start looking around. Huh. I'll be going alone. What? what? Why? That's a pretty stupid idea, don't you think? <laughs> Someone here might have already started thinking about murdering one of us. So it's best that I'm alone. <laughs> Are you saying we should stand around with them in our midst to make it that much easier for them? Hold on a second. Oh, wait a second! That it would have never! <laughs> Don't bother saying it couldn't happen. You can't deny the possibility. That's why you all sized up with- oh, seized up with fear <laughs> when that graduation rule was made clear to you. Am I wrong? Um, or am I just rich? <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is a spicy meatball. <laughs> so I'm simply acting in accordance with what I think is best for me. Extra did I say accordions? Yeah, you did. <laughs> Hold on. Like hell, I'm gonna let you run off and play the accordion whatever you want. What? Out of my way, Plankton. What? What the fuck is that supposed to mean? I- I control all of the gangs of the- I'm richer than you are. <laughs> it's a tiny sea creature. <laughs> One tiny bit of plankton drifting across the sea. Now unless you're a whale with baleen to eat the sea- <laughs> Never mind. So minuscule, so insignificant, they couldn't possibly have any kind of influence on the boundless ocean. But they- Unless they all were, went extinct, then the whales would die out, thus disrupting the ocean's delicate ecosystem and throwing the entire earth into chaos. Yeah. <laughs> anyway... <laughs> I'm gonna kick your ass! <laughs> oh, I'm gonna beat the fuck out of you. Oh, I'm gonna fucking <laughs> kick his ass, dude. <laughs> Stop it! We shouldn't fight! What? We should kill! The fuck you just said? <laughs> I'm gonna fuck his shit up, you some kind of goody goody little bitch. But. But. <laughs> that's you. Uh, oh no, that's me. Who do you think you are talking to me like that? You think you're my fucking dad or something? You're not my dad. No. You're not. <laughs> you're not. <laughs> no, I wasn't. You son of a bitch. Fuck you, Dad! I mean... Yeah. Wham. Wham? He punched me! And I flew back in a heap! It was like Take something my word straight for it. out of a comic book! I didn't even see the punch coming, it was just suddenly right there in my face. It's usually how punches work. One second <laughs> I was standing there, the next I was soaring through the air. Now that I think- It's almost as if he moved his arm in a punch-like manner, <laughs> and with his fist being connected to it, it then reached full extension of my face. <laughs> oh, so strange. Now that I think about it, maybe I'd kind of forgotten the kind of people I'd been trapped here with. My common sense had just stopped functioning. Being around all these ultimates had blown my fuses. So I guess I shouldn't be surprised it led to something as absurd as this. Yeah, you still should. But yeah. I just lost track of that sense of reality. And that was my last thought as my consciousness started to fade. I died. Game over. Before it finally come out completely. <laughs> come out. When I finally opened my eyes again, what I saw was... Oh, sick. Beow, beow, beow. Mm, gah. Huh? Where am I? As if it had become part of my daily routine, I woke up in yet another room I'd never seen before. Okay, so where am I now? <laughs> You now have access to the handbook menu. You can use this to check a variety of information as you play. Open the handbook menu by pressing. You, know, you can use this school regulations as a port card and yeah, save and love game. I think you probably should pay attention to this. Plus, is to view the transcript. These records are all pertinent info, so use this to review comments from everyone involved. Okay. Okay. I find it kind of strange how they make the windows like. 
it, it's just a nut and a bolt. Like, you could just unscrew the nuts and then... Yeah, you just need a large wrench to get rid of that wing nut. <laughs> it's not What's that rolled up paper towel? <laughs> Last night's spanker chip left, <laughs> was left wasted by the side of the bed. I think it's a cat roller. A lint roller. Oh. Some kind of lint roller. I guess we're supposed to clean up after ourselves? <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I'm gonna... <laughs> it's a notepad! I guess the school must have got given one to each of us. Good for writing .txt files. <laughs> There's some kind of metal plate mounted here. What about here? There's some kind of metal Shit, plate Shit, here too! <laughs> Is it to keep us all trapped in here? Y yes Great, great deduction. And what are these cameras for? To survey us? <laughs> a surveillance camera! I hate the idea that someone might be watching me right now. Well, time to undress! We're not allowed to mess <laughs> with the cameras, so I'd better make sure I don't touch it. Whoops! I touched it! <laughs> yeah. Beep beep! Beep beep! Beep beep! <laughs> Bed! <laughs> There doesn't seem to be anything particularly strange about the bed. I find that strange. <laughs> hey, keys! Catch! <laughs> this must be the key to the room. My name's written on the keychain. Which means it must be mine. <laughs> My name's written on the keychain. And then better hang. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hang on to it for now. <laughs> Trash. Just an everyday trash can. I don't see any kind of trap door or hidden compartments or anything. Nice! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Oh, sick. I saw the trash can. Mission accomplished. <laughs> There's a piece of paper hanging on the wall which says Announcement from Headmaster Monokuma. Each room's lock has been designated to completely protect against tampering or lock picking. Remaking an individual room key is quite troublesome, so please make sure not to lose yours. Your room comes furnished with a shower, but please note that the water is turned off at nighttime. Well, why? <laughs> Most people take showers at night. Also, the bathroom and the girls' rooms include a lock of their own. Finally, we've prepared a small gift for each of you. For the girls, a sewing kit. And for the boys, a tool kit. We gave Barbies to the girls and G.I. Joes to the boys. <laughs> the sewing kit includes a map of the body's vital organs. One stab will do the job, girls. For the boys, we believe a strong blow to the head with any of the tools should be ample. Don't think, just feel. Let's all enjoy ourselves. <laughs> Oh, thanks. I, f I really feel like I'm on a luxury cruise all of a sudden. <laughs> wow, they're really taking care of us here. I crumpled up the sheet of paper and threw it in the trash. Be nice! <laughs> Two points. <laughs> Two bear coins. <laughs> you just only get bear coins for interacting with the trash. <laughs> Ow! Some kind of monitor. Ugh. <laughs> okay. Door. This would appear to be the bathroom! Nice! Rattle, rattle. Huh? It's not opening. I guess it's locked. Maybe use the key? Uh... Do I have, like, access to the inventory to do that? I sure do. Not. For now, I should look around the room. Okay. I think I've seen everything. Yeah. Okay. All right, bye. Looks like this door leads outside. It's locked. So some of the rooms have locks, huh? I would assume all of them do. <laughs> Why only some? Yeah, you need to use the key. Unfortunately, the, uh, the instructions of how to use everything whizzed by for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm just trying to find the button on the... There we go. This is the, 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 the tab key, the R key to exit. The, the control is L shift. Control is L shift. What? Oh, I guess I'll just use the fucking keyboard, whatever. 
Whoops, I activated sticky keys. No. <laughs> no! <laughs> uh, okay. I don't think I have access to the inventory. I think it just wants me to do something else. How would you leave the room? I don't know, dude! Trash can! Nice! Oh, I think maybe I... No? It looks like I've... Try the drawer. Drawer? Next to the bed. Oh, I haven't done that yet. Okay, that's probably it. It looks like there's something in the drawer. It's a toolkit! Ah. Must be brand new, it's still in the shrink wrap. I don't really need it right now, so I'll just leave it here. Nothing to fix. What do you mean you don't need it right now? You might need to bash someone's head in at any moment. Yeah. I think I'm starting to understand. I have to kill someone. <laughs> this room might be my room. <laughs> sleeping anywhere other than the dormitory will be seen as sleeping in class and punished accordingly. This is my assigned dorm room. No shit, dude. Someone must have carried me here after I fell unconscious. So that answers that question. The next question is, who was it? What's everyone else up to right now? They could, Where is she? They couldn't possibly be in their dormitory rooms. That would be re weird. There's only one way to find out. And that's to get out of here. Let's get the fuck out of here. Alright. Leave the area? Yes. Oh, okay. I guess it had a lock on it, but wasn't locked. <laughs> hmm. Okay. I rushed out of the room to meet up with all the others, but there was someone waiting for me there. It was like something out of an old TV show. The audience ah. clapped and... Ah. <laughs> it's my favorite! Saizano! <laughs> yeah. Hey, Mamma Mia! Hey, what you, where you going? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Sayaka? Sorry. Sorry, are you okay? I'm fine! I'm fine. Oh, I'm okay. I hope you're okay! Sorry about that. <laughs> oh, she's saying it for real. She had an embarrassed smile on her face and stood up slowly. <laughs> Are you okay? She slowly handed me a calzone. <laughs> it was delicious! Are you okay, Sayaka? Are you hurt? Mm -hmm. You're making the sound worse than it is. I'm a completely fine. <laughs> <laughs> I know how I look, but I've actually built some pretty good muscle jumping up and down on the stage. <laughs> That's good, then. <laughs> But, uh, are you okay? Do you need some carbs? You know, from when Amando hit you? Oh, that's true. I got knocked out right there in front of everyone. I, I guess I revealed my lack of cool right from the beginning. M Makoto? Oh, I'm fine. I I no, I'm fine. Nothing wrong here. That's good. Oh, that's a good. I was kind of <laughs> worried. Woohoo! <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> By the way, what are you doing here? Um, I was just delivering this delicious pizza! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, alright. Actually, I came to get to you. You came to get me? Um, well, if you're really feeling better, I was hoping you could come to the dining hall. We're having a Oh spaghetti. my god. <laughs> <laughs> the dining hall? After you got it knocked out, everyone decided to go in and do the thing. We decided it would be more effective if we split up to investigate. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why this is loving me that so. So you're kind of my channel. <laughs> so we decided <laughs> to get it together and talk about what we each found out. So does that mean it's almost time to get back together? If that's what's going on, then of course I'll go with you. Good. Good. I'll go on ahead of me. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, okay. All right. Oh, everyone like sleeps in the same area. That seems kind of oh, easy that's to relaxing. Like, murder. Well, there are locks on all the doors. Oh, right. It looks like there's some kind of nameplate. <laughs> some kind of nameplate. The doors themselves all look pretty much the same. Okay. <laughs> Let's walk around in this town. Is this the cafeteria? <laughs> nah, it's just a place where they keep the silverware. <laughs> but only forks and knives. Spoons are in another room. They call it the silver warehouse. I think that's very clever. <laughs> this must be the dormitory dining hall. Um, it looks pretty clean, so that's good. <laughs> Er, uh, I guess that's not really important right now, with us being prisoners here and all. 
Yeah, that's true. Nobody was there waiting for us. We don't really have much choice. I guess we should just wait here for now. <laughs> hmm. Okay, let's just wait here. Huh? You heard that? <laughs> ah! <laughs> like I said, I'm a psychic. Come on, I'm just kidding. Seriously, I just have amazing intuition. Uh, is it really just intuition? <laughs> Try my pizza. The secret ingredient is intuition. Mmm, <laughs> <laughs> very savory. It's it's kind of sudden, I know, but here comes a tutorial. <laughs> ah! Oh boy! Right now, I'd like to talk about reactions. You're gonna be talking to Sayaka, right? Uh huh. Uh huh. Well, while you're talking to her, some purple words are gonna appear. This is how, here's how they work. When purple words show up, if you press the right mouse, right mouse button, you go into reaction mode. <laughs> the rice mount button. <laughs> At this point, you can use the wasp buttons to make a selection, and the left mouse button to confirm it. Also, when it comes to that dialogue, you can review whatever you talked about to look for more info. Talking to someone about things like this is called a reaction. Okay, do your best to enjoy your important school life. Oh, what school life? Um. Uh, action. Oh, okay, I have to select it. Ah, oh, you've gone ahead and used it already. Well, that's just wonderful. Make sure you keep it in mind as the story keeps on moving forward. Okay. All right, then. Um, I guess I'll talk to Sayaka. <laughs> Ow! Hey, um... <laughs> By the way, Makoto. Huh, <laughs> what is it? Um, well, uh, it's just, uh... I know this is kind of a... Continuing the self-introduction thing. But I... Wanted to ask you something. Can I press it on the... On the controller? Oh, whoops. Ooh, okay. I'll just do it on the mouse then. Boom. Continuing your self-introductions? Um... Well, we kind of got it cut off before, but I had a question I wanted to ask you. Sayaka wants to ask me something? Oh, I wonder what it what is. What part of the mother no. country are you from? Milano, Roma. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm really curious. Um. So, hey, ask um, me. By the way, Makoto. Um, well, it's just a. Okay, I wanted to ask you something. There you go. What do you want to ask me? Hmm. I'm Makoto. Did you happen to get to the Black Root of Junior High? <laughs> May, were you maybe in a class of two? Uh, yeah, actually I was. Ah, I knew it! I went there too! Boy, she has really good intuition. Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> yeah. I was in a class of four, though. Do you remember me? Do I remember? Even back in middle school, she was a celebrity with all kinds of ultimates surrounding her. How could I forget? Almost as surprising as her question was, that she remembered me! He, like flies off into space. <laughs> <laughs> we never even talked to each other, but somehow she still knew who I was. Hey, um, hey are you okay? Do you need to meet the boss? Of course, just plotting how to kill you. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, uh, uh, be who's hungry? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I'm just surprised is all. I wouldn't have thought you'd remember me. <laughs> oh, that's a very attractive that you say that. <laughs> we went to the same school for three years. Of course, I remember. Well, that's true, but there were lots of students in our grade, right? Plus, I've never been the type of person to ever really stand out. I'm a piece of shit. I'm average at everything. And all my hobbies are totally normal. Even normal would call me boring. Aww. Boy, you're really interesting to talk to. <laughs> what are you talking about? I love a man with a self-confidence. <laughs> you're so strange. Strange? That's... Ha uh... <laughs> She started giggling even louder. Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> that somehow mysterious smile of her makes my heart grow calmer. Her smile was the nicest smile I'd ever seen. That's good. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> anyway, I'm really glad that I know somebody here. <laughs> I mean, talking to you has made me feel a lot better about all this. You're, ama you're amazing, Makoto. No, I'm really not. Mama me. I'm not at all compared to you ultimates. <laughs> But you're the one who has helped me find my courage again, not any of those ultimate students. Thank you for saying that. Okay. And too, thank you for helping me out. I'm going to become your ultimate assistant. Huh? <laughs> Sorry, I meant assassin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. My, my assistant? <laughs> yep, I'm your assistant now. Just to turn around and don't look at me. Yeah. <laughs> 
Boy, you've got a really thin neck. Perfect for strangling. <laughs> oh, yes. I'm going to help you out as much as I can, so let's get out of here. When she says things like that, it... It just gets me pumped up! <laughs> <laughs> Which is nice, but still. Everyone else is still late. Besides that, I don't even know what time it is right now. I guess they're all dead. There must be a clock around here somewhere. Maybe that's what my power is, getting pumped up. <laughs> Did you hear that, Sayoko? I'm the ultimate pumper. <laughs> no, wait, uh... <laughs> oh, shit. I mean... <laughs> um, so what time is it right now? What? Seven o'clock at night? Uh, um... You were unconscious for a pretty long time. I tried to wave... <laughs> Cilantro and the, and the pastrami under your nose, but it never <laughs> didn't work. I see. Why am I blue now? Without being able to look out a window, I've lost all sense of time. Oh, cause it's nighttime. There's a giant window over there. There's literally. A that's. I think that's just a window into another part of the cafeteria. But there's a tree. The tree's on the inside. <laughs> My god, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> if I have to stay in this place for too long, I might just go crazy. Hey, um, I can't believe that there's no one here yet, but I'm sure they'll start to showing up soon. Almost like he'd been timed at. Like he- <laughs> Almost like he'd timed it. Yes. Okay. Talking through- I'm- I'm just a reading prodigy. Talking through <laughs> over the dining hall, horse right- the dining hall doors, right as Sayaka said. Wow. That. You want to just start from the top? <laughs> I Never forget mind. it. Never mind, it's too late. <laughs> ah, Makoto, Sayaka. So you two got here first, huh? <laughs> too bad. I was sure I'd beat everyone here. <laughs> but there's still time. <laughs> I guess that just means I don't have enough fighting spirit yet. Well, I won't give up. Next time, I swear I'll win no matter what it takes. Justice shall always prevail! Oh, we're definitely killing you. Yeah. That's a bit of much, don't you think? Yeah. And soon after that, everyone else came strolling in one after another. After a few minutes, everyone had gathered in the dining hall, which is basically what I just said, but backwards. Okay, it looks like everyone's here. Time to start the meeting! What meeting? Let's all go around and share what we found out during our respective investigations. Uh, we all are living the in a room. The sooner we find out what's going on, the sooner we get out of here. Okay. Hold on a sec. Oh. What are you talking about? <laughs> I like how the flavor what's... sound is longer than the actual text. I, I know, that's what I was commenting on earlier. It's so bizarre. What's wrong? What about, um, what's her name? You know the silver-haired girl? Uh, oh yeah, Kyoko. Hmm. What about her? Aww. She's not here. <laughs> what? <laughs> Start throwing up. That means she's somewhere else. <laughs> I took another look around the dining hall. Sure enough, she was nowhere to be seen. Um, I wonder where she went. Has anyone seen her? But everyone just shook their heads. Wait, so nobody's seen her? Why hasn't Kyoko shown up yet? I don't think anybody's seen her. Kyoko's not here. I haven't seen Kyoko. I guess she's not here. <laughs> <laughs> Could it be because... Yes, indeed. Uh, Staff, oh, stabbing, strangling, blitzing, crushing, hacking, drowning, igniting. How you do it, it doesn't matter. You must kill someone if you want to leave. It's as simple as that. <laughs> the rest is up to you. Give it all. Give it your all to achieve the best outcome in the worst way possible. Is it possible? Was she really? No, no, I'm just overthinking things. Darn it, Kyoko. You're really going to be late like this on the first day of school? Or dead? <laughs> One of those two things? <laughs> Next time on Game Grumps. Oh! Next time on Game Grumps, we'll find out if she's really dead or not. I don't know. Oh, man. It's, the, 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 it's so many possibilities. It's like she could be dead or not. Yeah, two. Two possibilities. <laughs>